Thank you. And you, you did mention Pam Lagosti's parking lot, and I want to tell you that she's got coffee and tea and bottled water inside. But the other part of that is she serves a great Italian dinner at night, so I would appreciate you all coming and supporting her from time to time. We, we love what she does. You know, Ridgeland is very fortunate that we have been able to, through proper planning, uh, come up with a, uh, and utilize a lot of federal dollars to help us keep our roads in good shape. We just announced uh, about a week ago a corporation with Jackson and Madison County to overlay in a fixed county line road. We're working now on Colony Park Boulevard. It's going to be built soon to carry it on from Sunnybrook Road to Highway 51. We'll be extending Lake Harbor Drive over to uh, Highland Colony Parkway. That project will be taking place starting this year. So there's a lot of construction that's going on. And in fact, later on this year, you'll see Oak Canton Road being uh, milled and overlaid in a state aid project working in Madison County. But this particular project, uh, the uh, milling and overlaying of uh, Lake Harbor from uh, North Park Drive going out to the to um, the city limits is is or to the the Breakers Lane is going to be a really important project for several reasons. One is this is one of the biggest commuter routes in the area for people coming in from Rankin County, um, coming in to shop and to do business in Ridgeland. So it's very important that this road be kept up to date and uh, the way it needs to be and. And so uh, we're excited about the fact that we're, through our planning process and working with Central Mississippi Planning Development, we were able to get a grant to be able to do this. Uh, we'll be working on this proce uh, process, and uh, later on this year, you'll actually see the project being done. But this is just another example of the fact that um, uh, the Mayor and Board of Aldermen and our staffs in Public Works really work hard to plan to get be sure that our transportation needs are taken care of here in the city. So this is ex an exciting day. Uh, you're going to see a lot of orange barrels in Ridgeland over the next little while, but uh, at the end of that, you have great transportation um, provided for our citizens and our guests, and that's just good for our economy. I want to thank you again for coming today. Uh, I guess we'll take any questions.